m times n times m plus m equals to 10. We have to find the value of m. So we can write it as m cube plus m minus 10 equals to 0 or m cube plus m minus 10 we can write it as minus 8 minus 2 equals to 0. Now let's rearrange it. We can write m cube minus 8 together then plus m minus 2 together equals to 0 or m cube minus 8 we can write it as 2 to the power 3 plus m minus 2 equals to 0. Now this is in the form of a cube minus b cube and this we can expand as a minus b times a square plus a b plus b square. So this we can write m minus 2 then times m square plus 2m plus 2 square then plus m minus 2 we can also write it as 1 times m minus 2 equals to 0. Now m minus 2 here is common factor so we can write m minus 2 common and then remaining factors are m square plus 2m plus 4 plus 1 equals to 0 or m minus 2 times m square plus 2m 4 plus 1 is 5 equals to 0 now when a times b equals to 0 then either a equals to 0 or b equals to 0 so first solution is m minus 2 equals to 0 in that case m equals to 2 when m square plus 2m plus 5 equals to 0. Now this is a quadratic equation. We can check whether m has a real solution or not using the discriminant formula. If b square minus 4ac is less than 0 then there is no real solution where a here is coefficient of m square that is 1. b here is coefficient of m that is 2 and c here is 5. So b square is 2 square minus 4 times a is 1 and c is 5. 2 square is 4 minus 4 times 5 is 20. So this is less than 0. That means no real solution. We can find the complex solution again using the discriminant formula where the roots of m we can find using the formula minus p plus minus b square minus 4ac under square root upon 2a b here is again 2 so it is minus 2 plus minus 2 square minus 4 times 1 times 5 upon 2 times 1 so minus 2 plus minus 2 square is 4 minus 20 upon 2 or minus 2 plus minus 4 minus 20 is minus 16 under square root upon 2 or this we can write minus 2 plus minus and minus 16 under square root we can write 16 under square root times minus 1 under square root upon 2 now this minus 1 under square root this is an imaginary number so we write i instead of it so minus 2 plus minus square root of 16 is 4 and minus 1 under square root we write i instead of it upon 2 take 2 common so minus 1 plus minus 2i upon 2 so this 2 and this 2 gets cancelled so two complex solutions for m will be first when minus 1 plus 2i and third is minus 1 minus 2i. So these are two complex solutions. Let's 
verify the solution m equals to 2 2 cube plus 2 this should be equal to 10 2 cube is 8 plus 2 equals to 10 therefore m equals to 2 is the real solution that we have how did you solve it let me know in the comment section thanks for watching